turns in a great effort today. How about that, friends? Wasn't that something? Dustin Flundra, Pincher Creek, Alberta. Look at this horse, how high he gets up in there. Dustin, even though he goes down, just reaches right up and starts to hoe it out of him again. And here come the markings coming in. 82 and a half, 82.5 is going to be his score. We Finals last year. This is a pretty cool matchup for Jake Bold, and he's excited about this horse. This horse is going to give him a little bit of grief down there in the bucket shoot, but Jake Bold, what a cool thing. He's got a lot of fans cheering him on, and we're excited to see him win a Canadian title. All right, he's out and after it right here, and there's Jake Bold, and makeup face is not making it easy for Jake Bold. Oh my goodness. Yeah, Jake. I don't think it's going to win the round right here because Makeup Face did a number on our champion. But, you know, when you've already got it clinched, that's a good thing because this horse really throws a couple of nasties at him early on and gets him kind of out of shape right about there. And you see those feet come back and the spur lick is over at this point in time. And so Jake Bold does uh, actually is, is able to kind of weather the storm. And uh, I think we're going to chat with the champion despite uh, maybe he struggled a little bit. We'll find out the score on this horse. Doesn't matter. He's the champion. What a great job he did. But how about this round of bareback riding where we had an... A year ago, Matt Lake from Cayley, Alberta. Makeup face might be one of the greatest horses you'll ever see in your life in rodeo. Watch this horse buck. He's a veteran, a 10-time CFR qualifier, and that horse did buck. 
And you talk about great ones, C5 Rodeo Company, they brought us some good ones again this year. Matt Late had a great score this afternoon, comes back and does it again in just a few hours, as my partner just pointed out. And this is the event that takes a toll on a cowboy's body more than any other event in rodeo. He's going to get up and walk away from the deal. Kyle Bowers, a Canadian champion as well, getting set to go right now. On the Texas Cowboy. The stars at night are big and bright. Former and half our horse, don't make up face the gray. And again, we are back to the sea back. Wow. Bird jumped out. The drum got started as he failed to march him out. Then it just got tougher. You don't see that often, but that good cowboy. Boy, that's a bucking horse now, let me tell you what. Two-time world champion and a man that's currently... Rattler for Team B&W, and he winds up with no score. Well, you can see why I thought he had a chance on monkey face. This horse, though, is as strong at seven seconds as he is that first or second jump. He's a handful.